Susan. Hi, Susan. How are you? So, yes, Susan. Yes. I'm flipping the camera. <laughs> hey, guys. <laughs> Is that me? You can't see me. I'm in black. Oh, hey, there I am. So hi everybody out there in Facebook land. I'm waving to you. You can't see I'm in the back of a Mercedes SUV. I'm being chauffeured. All, all Thank you. Nobody. Like the paparazzi. All of you, nobody. Hey. <laughs> How many people tuned in? It's, it's like 30 <laughs> seconds, okay? So we're just coming back from Logical. It's what time in the morning? God knows. 12.25. 12.25 in the morning. And I had a fabulous time at Logic Cal LA. And I'm in a car with men, so life can't get much better. Except that means that nobody's gonna pull over when I gotta go pee. Oh, thank you, I've got a, hey! Hey, thank you, Darren. So, <laughs> they all, <laughs> I look like a ghost. Hi, everybody, is anybody here yet? I just wanna say hi, we had a really great time. Got to hang out with some, freaking awesome people and I miss all the people already and um, these guys over here are just annoying as hell so let me <laughs> camera so well, we can say hi. Well hello say, say hi Tom. Hi Tom. Here's our chauffeur for the night. We've got about a five hour drive from LA to Morgan Hill, California and this is Leonard Trammell. Hi. You can't even see because it's just a big black floor. Yeah, there, there. Hi there. Oh, there he is. Hi, Leonard. Hi. This is Darren. Hey, how you doing? Good. You can't see him at all. Another blur. And um, so I'll let you guys watch the traffic. I think it's better as we go. There's the traffic. I'm so excited. Yeah. Right. So they were singing songs to me. They were singing hallelujah. Yeah, because because God. Because God. So, you guys had a great conference. <coughs> the best part of it was As usual, the George Rob sing-along, the George Rob sing -along, which is great. I got video for that, everybody. You guys, you got to keep an eye on that. And then I got that caricature from Celeste. I freaking well love done. it. That, that was really so nice. awesome. And, and Colin videotaped her making the caricature, and I haven't got a chance to look at it yet, and I'm really looking forward to that. Sean Carroll supposedly was amazing, according to everybody who understood his lecture, which was everybody but me. <laughs> um, I can't wait for the video so that I can like slow it down, pause, look it up, look up all the definitions on Wikipedia, play a minute later, pause, go look up all the definitions on Wikipedia so I can understand what he said. Try to find YouTube videos that'll tell me what it is he's up. Uh, He's up. That's not showing me. No. Yeah. I'm, I'm video okay. the road. Because it's um, And that was fun. I met a lot of cool new people. And I think they're having problems finding my my feed. Because I don't, there's nobody here. I think it's the internet like that. Because there's nobody there right now. But, <laughs> but I'll hit publish and it'll be there. Yes. And all 10 of my fans. Ten of my friends will look at all it. All your friends, you both of more them. Than ten. All ten of them. You have a bajillion friends. I, you can't have a bajillion. The max is some. Five thousand. The max is five thousand. But you can have many followers. People like your page I have seven hundred and thirty-six followers. A bajillion is a new word. I know this is gripping video. You're watching us on what highway are we on? We're on Highway 5, Interstate 5. We're going to sing 99 bottles of beer on the wall, but because we have five hours to drive, we're going to start at what number? <laughs> One. Uh, yeah. Bajillion. Robert, no singing, please. So I did have a friend. I have a friend. 
I have a friend. He has joined us live. Thank you, Robert. Hi, Robert. Hey, yeah. Bob. Thanks. He he made it so he told you guys to shut up. So. <laughs> Thank you, Bob. Is that rest No, it's it's Robert's safety and you don't know him. I play pool with him. We play pool, huh, Bob? Well, we haven't in a while, but we play a kick-ass game of nine ball. You guys don't know this, but I can play pool. Really? I can play pool and I can almost beat, like, maybe someone who started. <laughs> but I love pool. I absolutely love nine ball. Maybe be able to beat somebody. Somebody who's, like, maybe on their, you know second day or something. I've won a couple games, but I love it. I love it. So, um, yeah, we're on Highway 5. This is great. Look, there's a semi. Hey, there's a story. I got a really good story. Okay, I do have a really good story. I'm going to tell everybody. So, I went to Tacoma, to Psycon. Leonard, were you with me when we were leading the Yes. Okay, so Leonard was with me. Oh, God, Leonard and I have known each other for a while. Joe Nickel, Leonard, was who else? Was in the car that they, you know, they pick you up from there, from the hotel, and they take you to the airport. And we had been at this conference, and Bill Nye was at the conference. Yep. And he was just finished his Dancing with the Stars. Yeah, it was fun. Like the it was so much fun. So here we are. God, who was the other person, Leonard? The other conference person that was in the van with us as we were going to well, the. There were there were other. Yeah, there were, but they were from the conference. Yeah, I'm trying to remember. That, I think that guy, Gala guy, he was there, or uh, it wasn't Robert Schaefer, was it? No, it was. Um, no. Oh my gosh, I can't remember who it is. So I apologize if I can't think of it. Is anyway, so we're driving back. Pool hustler. Yeah, Robert says Bob yeah. says I'm a pool hustler because I'm I'm saying I can't play very well. And actually, that is what you do. You, you downplay how you play so that you can get money off you. Anyway, so we're, we're driving back, and we're in a car of maybe 10 people. And we just had such a good time at this conference. We're talking about the conference. And we're there with Joe Nickel. And the uh, we're just having a blast talking about Bigfoot and everybody in the van was so engrossed in our conversation. There was four of us, I think. We were just talking and talking to each other. And they're like, you just got back from a conference. We're like, yeah, we, Bill Nye was the keynote. And within what, two or three minutes, a van, a, a bus, a city bus drives by with a Bill Nye <laughs> at Tacoma, CFI Tacoma Summit. Goes, cruises by and we're like, right there, right there, yeah, that's we're, Bill we're Nye. That we were just there at that conference. Hi, Christina, I see you. Hi. Somebody named Christina just joined us. Hi, Christina. Christina, they said hi. We can't hear them. So that was such a fun thing. And, and it summed up the whole conference for me. Because on the way back, because there was people in the car that were saying, you know, I've lived in the Northwest for so long, and I've never seen a Bigfoot. And that's where they say, you know, they're supposed to be here. Because we were in Tacoma, Washington. And uh, Washington. It's, it's a special place. Yeah. It's near Washington. It's, it's near, near Washington. <laughs> very close. It's very close to Washington. No, it's Washington. very close to Washington. Washington. It's not in Washington. Exactly. So it's a special season. So it was really fascinating to, uh, you know, we're talking about UFOs and kind of cool stuff like that. You see, we're talking about UFOs and then we look out the window and then we see Mount Rainier. Oh yeah, so we see Mount Rainier. A cloud right next to it. Yeah, a cloud of Mount Rainier. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm repeating really what you're saying. Cloud formations here. Yeah, it is. Uh, but no one got a good picture of it. It was a cloud. But it was uh, that was fun. So I mean, conferences are a blast. Yep. What was your favorite lecture, you guys, besides Sean Carroll? Sean Carroll. Sean Carroll. Besides Sean Carroll. <laughs> Sean Carroll. <laughs> I like I like God, God Sod a lot. I God Sod, I'd never heard of him before. I would heard of him before, and he's he's he gives, talking about controversial social, you know, uh, sociology, you know, science. With social yeah, but science. he's using science. He's using science. Yeah, you know, uh, science. Science. Science bitches, it works. Science bitches. I heard a lecture. Who was it who did the lecture on the science bitches? It works. Was it uh, oh, uh, Bill Plate? Or what do you mean? 
Who? Tonight, tonight they said it. Who no, there it? was a, there was a lec- there was a lecture that ended with, as Richard Dawkins said, science. It works. No, I'm basically. talking about a town lecture that said that that's a problem. That this is a problem that people use this phrase. Because what happens is, and I'm trying to remember uh, if it was a man. Is this an SJW thing? Huh? Is this I, I have never, warrior problem? I have never heard of a, an objection. Okay, so the lecture was, and it might have been Lawrence Krauss, I can't remember. But the problem with the phrase, science works, it's bitches, is that we, we get complacent and think that we don't have to fight the fight because we feel like we're the right and that uh, science is going to win out in the end but the person who did the lectures argument was you need to stand up for science you need to because even though it is correct and you know it's right we can still lose because people are going to start taking away um, you know like a trump administration is doing now you know they're yeah. going to they're going to put in bad science and that if you get to a point where your attitude is you know, it's always going to win. Science is the best. Then, um, you know, you got to fight for it. Mm. Even though it's right, you ha- still have to come back and you have to back it up and you have to fight for it. God, I wish I knew who that said that. But, I mean, it, it, using that phrase is somehow causing us to be more complacent? Is that the, is that I the argument? I guess that was what his argument was, is that we were probably, we, we were just, and it is true, the, our community can be pretty apathetic. And we get to a point where we say, okay, like let's say with the RFK and the, and the vaccines and stuff like that, it's like, well, vaccines work. And, and, but science works, you know, vaccines work. And if you get to a point where you're just saying that, hmm. you forget that they can come back and they can take, take this away. Yeah, I don't know. I, I think this is a special case of the general uh, fact that's well summarized by the statement, all that is required for evil to win is for good men to do nothing. Yeah. Oh, I like that. But what about women? And I, as I was saying that, I was thinking of paraphrasing it in a more modern, uh, with more modern vocabulary. I'm triggered. And that would be to say, to say that- <laughs> Tom's triggered. He's gender fluid. And he's driving. That, that only, yeah, you don't want to trigger only, me, I'm driving. The only thing that's required for evil to win is for good people to do nothing. What about Smurfs? Um, I frankly don't care. I'm an anti-Smurfist. Alright. How about witches? I'd like to meet one. Uh, how about bitches? <laughs> I'd bet those. <laughs> I'd bet those. I'd bet those. Those are much more common. <laughs> Well, my, my son, for example, has a female dog. Oh. His dog okay, is, his, his pet yeah. dog is female. Well, what so does she I, think about the... Yeah, what is she... How's, she I've, I've, how's that working out for her? She's um, triggered. She's actually... <laughs> she was abused when she was a puppy. Aww. Um, so she was Aww. actually... She has... Hey, my likes just went up on the video. She has <laughs> several um, uh, shotgun pellets in her Aww. leg. She was... Aww. Yeah, so as a result, she's very, very timid. I did get likes. I did get likes. And oh appara- my God. Apparently. Thank you. The person it's because there's, no there's no hate button. There's no hate button. Apparently the person that did this, as near as we must have been, there's there's a hate button. must have been a man with a beard. Yeah. Because she's very, very scared of men with beards. Oh, wow. So it's, it's taken... So you have to shave your beard off every time you see the dog? No, it's just going to take a long time till the dog is comfortable with it. Are you traumatizing the dog slowly by like slowly going around the corner? You put a napkin over your face and then you slowly remove the napkin? I would never do that to the dog. To kind of get it adjusted to your beard? No, I sit calmly in the same room as the dog. Dog, you know, calms down eventually. I'll give the dog a treat, you know, let it eat it out of my hand. And I don't, you know, make sudden moves. I'm trying to be very nice to the dog. Leonard Chamel, everybody, live from Highway 5. I guess I should keep my hands on the wheel. Interstate yes. 5. All right. And Bob hey, Sapien is still listening yeah. to this I don't video. know why. We just switched sides again, I so now that. we're on the left side of the freeway. Yeah, again. We're in New Zealand. How did that happen? I know. It's rather We're in, we're in Australia. Cayman Islands did the same thing. Uh-huh. 
Australia and New Zealand okay, both drive on the other side, right? Good night, everybody. Just put it on, put it on uh, self-drive. On self-drive, right. It's, of course, you don't have that need, on I here. can like, it's not that you need, I can drive something to I'm filming yeah, this. You better watch out. Your wife is going to get a hold of it. I know. She's going to. She's oh. probably sitting there at home and right now, car. watching the live video feed, going, "Tom, Tom, yep, I drive can. like a normal person. I could drive like a sane man." I could probably tell her I could share, but I'd have to like pick up my phone and start using it while I'm driving. Don't do, don't this do is that. a live feed. Don't do that. I shouldn't do that. But you know. it's a live feed. But what is its? Um, all my friends. Security. Yeah, and if, I have no security. It's public. It's, so it's said it's to be public? I'm a public figure, so everything is public. public figure. Everything I do is public. I'm sorry to hear that. Except for everything that I do on Wikipedia. Are you like a celebrity? Uh, if, uh, I, I heard that celebrities can get away with anything. I can grab pussies. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's exactly. But I'm, I like cats. <laughs> The only pussy I want to grab, sorry. <laughs> Leonard's doing the sigh. Oh, thank the, you, the Robert. Bob so said nice. drive safe. I can He's going to leave you, the conversation now. Thank you, Bob. But now, thank you, Bob, because you said that we will drive safe yeah. now. Thank you for yeah. reminding us that yeah, we, we don't want to die. Otherwise, it would have been something that we'd never think of. I've got some great video and some great photos and stuff in my camera that I don't want to oh hey Who we have we have uh, Ludwig hello Ludwig I don't want to say your name out loud because I'm afraid that I'm gonna really mess up your first name it's R U with two little little lots D I G E R how would you pronounce your name Ludwig Ludwig well, actually, see, the part of the problem is, is that the car is moving as I'm... Rüdinger. Yeah, thank you. Okay, no problem. So it's hard to read what's on the thing. Don't be saying anything. Uh, hey, could somebody watching this video ask us a question so we can feel like we're in a... Yeah, like it's live feed and it's a thing and it's... So I know you're there. Yeah, I know. Okay. Five. How many people do you have listening? I don't know. How do I know? Does it have a little eyeball at the top of the thing? Yeah, it's got two. Two. So two people are watching. Well, they're all asleep. <laughs> the eyes closed. All two of them. <laughs> the little eye icon is closed. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, now it's down to one. <laughs> oh, and it's a negative, too. <laughs> How do you have negative people watching? They're negative. They're negative. <laughs> they're gone. They're gone. <laughs> oh, thanks. Oh, thanks, thanks a lot. Right. Well, that's it. I think that's the end of that video. I guess I should say goodbye to my no non-existent non -existent public. The non-existent people. <laughs> All right, people. Okay. Nobody's there. It says live, but nobody there. Thank you. I from think it's because we're out of coverage and. No, oh, like, that's probably no, true. It's just it's live. No, it's a bad area. I've got a one a again. Uh, do you have bars? No, it's off. Yeah. I can't tell. Yeah, the, the coverage is going to be bad over here. But it's still recording. Yeah, yeah it's still recording. Well, I don't know. It'll record onto the phone. Because my phone's thing. recording. But It'll publish. In Facebook uh, live mode, I, it's, it's, it's shoving it all into this into the Facebook server. I don't know how it's doing. Well, there's got to be some buffer. Yeah, some buffer, but I don't, I don't know the not big. very much. With all the technology in this car, with all the experience of all these people in my car right now who are driving with me that have, I mean, we should be able to make a time machine or something <laughs> just with the three of you guys. Time, time machines are harder than you yeah. think. Or a transporter. So those, are, those are bad too. Transporter. If I could transport you anywhere right now, where would you go? Home. Home. To my bed with my cat. Morgan Frickin' Hill. Morgan Hill? Yeah, that'd be nice. I know, wouldn't life be completely different if we had transporters? I mean, nothing would be like, no, nothing would, would be. be very different. It would be no, it'd different. be beyond different. It'd be like. It would be like this. Because you could, you, there would be, nobody would need parking spots. Parking meters. So roads. Whenever, whenever a transporter comes up, it might be if actually such a thing would occur, depending on the technology that was used to make it happen. 
are we essentially making a copy of ourselves? We're making a copy, yeah. And if you're making a copy of yourself, why not keep the copies? And it, uh, what, what is the fact? Actually, there's a very good reason. Ethical. There's a, there's a ethical schmethical. So Somebody's going to do it. Forget Sarah, ethical. Sarah just no, joined can't, the conversation. Can't be done. Oh, I think I know why. Because it, it, depending on... So depending what, on how, what, it, what, how it's done. Depending on how it's done. One, if, one, 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 this much plausibility uh, that has that is has to do with uh, uh, when you uh, tra when you as, as far as I know you you will scramble this the original when you send. When yeah, you, so there is a uh, so assuming that you make a quantum mechanically perfect yeah, copy. Right. Oh my God! Yeah. We said the word quantum. Yep. Uh, then there is a, a theory exactly. that can be proven in um, quantum field theory yep. called the no cloning theorem. Right. So you cannot take a object and make an exact copy of it. You destroy you, the original. You have to do something bad to the original. So if you clone, if you transport this by making a, a, it, a particle by particle clone, it's then so, the it's original so goes away. Because it, when the creators of Star Trek had no idea about Correct. how this would work, but it turns out that it's not too bad right. the it, way that it works in the show, right? Yeah, it, it turns out <laughs> that you can't do what we were just worried about. Yeah. Can you guys say hi to say, Sarah? Hi, hi Sarah. Sarah. Thank you. Hi, Sarah. There you go. He did it with his cute little accent, Sarah. Say hi again. Hi again. He's got a cute little accent from the South. Style. South Central. Ah, 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 ah. Thank you, thank you. I'll be here in the car for the next few hours. <laughs> I'm gonna curl up in the corner and go to sleep. Good so night. Good night, Susan. Good night, Susan. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave the live feed on. <laughs> Just if I go to sleep, I'm leaving story. my camera. I'm gonna leave the video on so that I can hear everything you say. And I'm gonna leave it right Susan, there. If you do that, you'll just run the battery down. Do you see what kind of phone I have? It's a phone. Do you know how much technology I have with me right now? Uh, yeah. I could I could launch a space. I have more technology than this than, than the they went to the moon on. And there's a picture of on your phone. Yeah, I know, but uh, so I've got I got more to the I've moon. Got, I've got more computation ability in my watch. Yes, I'm aware of that. I've got more computation ability here. Yeah, my little finger. Um, I'm not sure what the little In my big shoe. Uh, depending on what sort of implant you have there, maybe. <laughs> I was telling that, hey, I'm filming this time. <laughs> That's going to keep me alive. Um, I, you remember I was telling you about that lady who was asking me those questions? We're going to do this again. You know what? Yeah. You know what? I really was able to help her. I'll help him with this jacket. Yeah, thank you. Uh, Speed off. Got it. I, thank you. Works better if you're going. Uh, much better. Stripping people. We could have produced place for seductive music. We lost all our followers. With any luck. No, they went negative. Again. He's dead, Jack. Okay, I'll put the freaking seatbelt on. Shut oh, we didn't have a seatbelt on. Thank for a you. second. For, you your sure? wife is watching this. And your kids. And, and your it's grandkids. I'm not sure that way down here. Oh, got, it got really warm in here. It did. I'm turning it down. Uh, Better? It just seemed to really jump up in temperature there. It's because of the butt warmer. I'm turning off the video because, because there's nobody watching. So say goodbye to all those people who are going to be watching the video whenever it's live. Goodbye all the people goodbye. who are watching the video that is not live. Good, goodbye to all the people that watch this not live. I want Darren to say something in his accent. Yo.